Here's a quick tutorial on how I crochet with grids. It's the same technique I used for these wall hangings. You can pretty much use any grid or 8-bit image. I found mine off of Pinterest, but you can make your own by pixelating an image. You'd start by chaining the number of squares there are at the bottom of the grid. I chained 62, and then chain the height of your stitch. I like to use single crochet for grids because they're very square, so I chained one. So I would start from the bottom right and snake my way through the chart. When you get to the point where you are one stitch before the color change, the last yarn over and pull through with this stitch will be with the new color. This way, the top of the next stitch will have the color change. For the first color, I usually carry it through by just crocheting over top of it, but you can also cut and weave in the ends. It gets a lot easier as you go along because you can use the color blocks that are already there and count the stitches away from them. If I ever get lost and don't know if I'm doing the good side or the reverse side, I just check what side the tail end is on. For me, the good side is when the tail end is on the left. When I'm doing the reverse side, it will be on the right. This helps me to keep track of when to flop the chart in my mind. And that's pretty much it. You just keep snaking through the grid. This is going to be a tote bag when it's done. Follow to see the finished results.